Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's B. Avery here again for another trailer reaction. This one is for Star Wars Episode 8, The Last Jedi. This trailer dropped during the halftime of Monday Night Football. Uh, I can't wait for this movie. Very, very excited about it. One of my most anticipated of the year. But, like, real quick, so, like, I'm a Star Wars fan, but I'm not, like, a diehard, super duper, you know, diehard fan. Like, nothing wrong with that. It's just, like, I've seen all the movies. I've seen, of course, the original trilogy, you know, which I have here on Blu-ray. Uh, right here, I've seen that back like in junior high, like when in the nineties, and I, you know, I loved it. Uh, seeing Looper, got that right here. Director Ryan Johnson, you know, he did this, which was great, and he's doing episode eight. And out of episode uh, seven, The Force Awakens and Rogue One, I like Rogue One better. So I just want to tell you about that real quick. But I am a Star Wars fan. I've seen all the movies. I haven't seen um, like the Clone Wars. Or uh, Star Wars Rebels, that show. I do want to see uh, Rebels, if that's the name of the show. If not, I'll excuse me. Uh, but I am looking forward to this movie. So um, you probably just want to hear me react. So let me stop wasting your time. Put on these headphones. And you guys can stop listening to me talk. And watch me watch this trailer. Really hoping we get to see Luke with a lightsaber or something. But uh, here we go. When I found you, I saw raw, untamed power. Look at that talking. And beyond that, something truly special. Yes. Is that so? has always been there. But now it's awake. And I need help. Yes. I've seen this raw strength only once before. It didn't scare me enough then. It does now. <laughs> Die. Kill it. If you have to. That's the only way to become what you were meant to be. You don't kill your mama? So true. We are the spark. Rematch? Yeah. <laughs> this is not going to go. Oh, what is that? The way you think. Fulfill. Your destiny. Oh, who is that? I need someone to show me my place in all this. Wait a minute. Oh no! She's going to the dark side! <laughs> I'm sure they'll at least have the conversation. December 15th. What is that? Uh, a little over two months from now. Because what's today? October the 9th. So a little bit more than two months just right there. It was a good trailer. Uh, great trailer. I wasn't like blown away, as you can see. Uh, from my reaction i'm like oh my god you know like i've been in other trailers um but like i said i'm not like the biggest star wars fan i'm a fan i'm, I'm excited about it you know uh, i really want to see luke go off with a lightsaber because um what has he been doing this whole time i want to know and it looks like we're going to get a lot of that it looks like we're going to get a lot of ray training as well uh look like uh finn or I, I don't know i can't remember nobody name look like he is gonna get uh, a remix with uh with phasma or whatever and um uh, yeah i mean it looks good wasn't blown away by the trailer um but that's good because at the same time you know that just means that everything is going to be safe for the movie and you know that's always a good thing because trailers these days you know give away too much and this one i don't feel gave away much at all i mean we got a brief glimpse in the first trailer and we got 
just a little bit more in this trailer right here. Um, I don't feel spoiled at all. Uh, what we did see right here looks good, but um, I feel like there's just so much. And I, you know, the, and now that what I think about, it, I'm I'm very excited because um, you know this trailer didn't show much, or at least I just feel that it didn't. You know, and um, what was his name? J.J. Abrams was saying that he's a little jealous because you know he feels that the script that Ryan Johnson put together is possibly superior to his please excuse me if i misquoted that i'm extremely paraphrasing here but you know um i don't know i feel like this trailer did not spoil anything at all that we're just getting a brief brief glimpse um you know luke in this he didn't even look powerful you know it looked like he was struggling a little bit and that's fine because you're not ruining anything in the trailer like i've said a thousand times you know so um i'm excited not blown away, but I am still excited and uh, I cannot wait for Star Wars Episode 8, The Last Jedi. My guys, that is just my opinion. What did you think of the trailer? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did it turn you on? Did it turn you off? Do you agree with me or do you disagree with me? Let me know in the comment section below. Let's get this conversation going and keep it flowing. If you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And if you don't like the video, that's fine. Just leave me a comment below why and still give me a thumbs up. Since you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel channel to get all the content that i have to provide you can click the bell so you can be notified when i make uploads also guys you can go to my website check me out there bookmark and i do have written reviews and you can also look me up on social media facebook instagram and twitter it's right there at the bottom of the screen and i made it very easy for you guys by providing a link for all of that in the description box down below and guys i just want to thank you again for tuning in to my opinion slash reaction for the latest star wars the last jedi episode 8 trailer dropping dropping december 15th and before you go don't forget and my name is Brandon Keith Avery, and that's just my opinion. Peace.